Welcome back. Today I'm going to offer a quick demonstration on the YouTube sidebar widget. This is one of my favorite widgets for um, putting video on the sidebar in our WordPress website. Uh, it's relatively simple. It's a great tool. If you notice here, I'll click on it. It brings the video up in a pop-up. So it's not asking the person to leave your website per se or go to another page of the site just to watch a quick video um, that you might want to present to somebody as they're looking around. So how do I do this? Well, my favorite widget for this is the YouTube sidebar widget. Once you have installed the widget, and this one's going to be by Stephen Coley, and once you've installed this widget uh, and activated it, you will find the option in your widgets. It's called YouTube Widget Sidebar. Um, simply open the sidebar, give it a title, and then you can choose from the video ID, uh, your YouTube video ID um, for a specific video, your username, your YouTube username, uh, which would be everything that falls behind that youtube.com forward slash user forward slash, and then playlist ID. I like to use the playlist ID. That way I can bring in something specific on a page like this. This is a, a page with recent listings, and so on that I want to bring in a recent listings playlist. So how do I do that? Well, once I've created my playlist in YouTube, I can simply go to the playlist itself, and then I click Share, and then I simply just grab this link right here. Once I have the link of the playlist that I want, I go back to the widget and I simply paste that link here. Uh, I choose to have the titles display. You can add, you can um, choose how many videos you want to show up in that sidebar widget. Uh, you can determine whether or not they autoplay. Now autoplay is referring to when you open it at this point. It won't autoplay in the left sidebar. Um, And then the next, the last was you can set the pixel width or the for the thumbnail. So that way you don't have it hanging off the sidebar too small or scrunched up. You can uh, set your width just perfectly. And that's one of the features that I like about it because it, it does allow you to uh, make it fit your website properly. You simply hit save and you're done. And now you have an option to drop in video widgets. And as you drop these in throughout your website, and as you can see on the bottom of our website, we use um, video everywhere. We like it. The sidebar widget's my favorite version. Sometimes I'll use the code straight from uh, YouTube, but on the sidebar in an instance like this where I just want a quick pop-up, I use the YouTube sidebar widget. If this video was helpful, please give us a thumbs up, give us a comment, and subscribe to our channel. Thanks. Have a great day.